was cracking. There you go. I got the echo for you guys tonight. Now let me get back to normal. So, oh shit, hold on. I'm getting a little hyphy with it. Hyphy for the barrier. So, you guys see the uh, the thumbnail? Damn, I'm all tangled up right now. You guys see the thumbnail? So, you guys know that uh, when I make a video, um, I never acknowledge the existence of certain things because um, they don't exist, right? But um, I also don't like to say names of disruptive groups and all that. When I do talk about certain people, um, if you guys only knew what was going on with my wire right now, you guys would be laughing. But anyways, um, I, I do call a certain group legends right and there's the big four we'll just say that you guys know who the big four is those of you that know know those of you that don't i'm glad you don't and you don't need to know but those are the legends of various factions right and it's a trip how every now and then i get heat in the comment section right why do you call them legends you know, um, you're glorifying this and you're glorifying that. And no, I'm not. So I decided with this video, I'm going to try to at least uh, give a little bit of insight on why I call them legends, right? Now, let me preface that with I'm a civilian, I'm a content creator. I live by the laws of society. However, for the majority of my life, I live by the rules of the streets and then the rules of prison, right? Um, and throughout my, my prison and my, my, my criminal history, my criminal career, my prison career, there were a select group of individuals who um, were willing to sacrifice and go above and beyond for what they believed in. Um, while I do not condone those activities anymore, I respect them. And that's why I call them legends. You know, they go by other names behind the walls. And those names I won't refer to. You know, those of you that know, you know. Um, but me, I understand that what they do is not easy. It's a sacrifice. Every single thing that they do is a sacrifice. When someone is willing to dedicate themselves to something, regardless of what it is, if they're doing it 100%, you don't got to agree with it. You could, you could believe it's foolish, it's stupid or whatever, but you got to respect the fact that they're that dedicated, right? Um, I know having been behind those walls and having struggled and sacrificed myself, um, I know how much more that those legends have to sacrifice. And I think that the people that make these comments on, you know, how can you call them a legend? And I think you've never sacrificed at all in your life. Um, I try not to pass judgment on other people because I really truly believe that the judgment that you pass on to others will be the same judgment that you're going to have to go through, right? And so I, I don't want to be judged by nobody, but at the same time, uh, in the comments, I, I'm telling you, you know, it, it, it just it pops out to me when, when people say that, you know. Someone I remember, it, it just it stuck in my head. They were like, maybe, you, you know, they're infamous, but they're not famous. They're not legendary. You know, what kind of message are you sending to the kids? You think the kids don't know about these legends, whether they're white, whether they're black, whether they're Mexican? Um. I think that 
every video that I put out shows how detrimental that way of life is to someone's freedom, to their livelihood, and to their life. I don't ever glorify that stuff. So for me to call someone a legend, believe that they earned that. It's out of respect. You know, I think that it's so easy for people to sit behind um, their phones or their computers and not put their face on the little, I don't know what the hell it is, that little, that little round thing, you know. It'll be a letter A, a purple letter A, a green letter J. Um, to me, that's coward shit, you know, like. Uh, if you really want to disrespect those men, go behind those walls and dis disrespect them. Otherwise, try to understand they're from a different planet than you. I've said that so many times and it seems like people just don't get it. Prison is not of this planet. They are their own planet. They have their own set of rules. While they were on the streets, they lived by their own set of rules. And you're trying to apply societal rules to people who disregard those rules. It doesn't work that way. Um, I don't know if this is going to make sense to everyone. But it makes perfect sense to me. And I know that everyone that has behind, been behind those walls. It makes perfect sense to them. Those people sacrifice. Is it selfishness at times? It is. But at the same time. It's hard as a motherfucker to do what they do. You may not agree with it. Most don't. But again, acknowledge how hard it is. What it takes. 99.9% .9 of people cannot do what they did. Cannot achieve what they've achieved. So give them their respect, you know. Uh, like unlike other channels, you know, I do not like to use the names of these groups because they don't use the name. So why should anybody else? And speaking of that, those of you that get in my comment section and you guys use these uh, two and three letter words or two and three letter titles for these organizations, understand that I will remove those because again. If those individuals that are actually a part of that, that have earned their way in, do not admit the existence of that thing that they are a part of, then you shouldn't be throwing those words around and those, those initials around. Uh, those that know anything about them, if you've been blessed enough to be told something, keep that to yourself. So anyways, I'll go ahead and bring this to a close. But that's why I refer to people as legends. Um, and I try to show respect regardless of what faction it is, what organization it is. They're a legend. Whether you believe it or not, they've earned that. So go ahead and be safe, be smart, and tell the ones you love that you love them. I'm out.